Hello and welcome to Red Gaming Tech for yet more of your daily gaming news of myself, Amasa. Today I have some news for you on Football Manager 2014 as the release date has been revealed for the game as well as a few other details concerning the changes and pre-order bonuses for this particular title. Now it has been revealed by Sports Interactive that Football Manager 2014 will launch on Thursday the 31st of October basically at one minute past midnight GMT. Now of course this is on PC, Mac and Linux. However, if you do pre-order from one of participating retailers you can gain access to a beta version and this is around two weeks before the full game's full game goes on sale excuse me and you can carry on the career you start in the beta when you buy the full version and there will be a demo released a week before the full game so essentially if you pre-order you get a week's early access you get what well, technically it's two weeks before the game comes out one week before the demo comes out so it's quite a nice little thing to give and could even help iron out some final bugs before the release as well which is a nice little gift to give to anyone pre-ordering the game i'm sure we will prefer that over some gimmicky little outfit or what have you when you pre-order the game now obviously cloud saves are supported so you can continue your career on any of the platforms pc mac or linux look worldwide as long as they meet minimum specs and this is of course by logging into your steam account and installing the game and downloading your cloud save now football manager classic players will be able to continue their career while out by using the PS Vita. Now the PS Vita version is the first handheld version of Football Manager to feature the 3D match engine. And of course, <clears throat> what is the best news of all, at least in my opinion as a big fan of modding, is that there will be integration with the Steam Workshop, which means you'll be able to create and share game skins, graphics, and of course customize and share databases, which will include additional leagues and nations, and of course customize competitions. So a nice little feature to have in there. I'm a big fan of modding, as I previously said. I genuinely believe it very much extends the life of a game, the shelf life of a game, and basically just gives people a way to keep playing their favourite game by creating new content. Obviously many, many games have shown us this over the years, so it definitely pleases me to see when any game includes a little bit of tweaking available via the Steam Workshop or anything like that. So i say the best piece of news in that video, of course, the release date, the Steam Workshop integration and the, the PS Vita thing. So if you do happen to own the Vita version and you want to perhaps just play your career while you're out traveling or whatever, you can do so, which is a pretty nice feature indeed. And I'm sure that's going to please many people who perhaps just want to play it well on the go for whatever reason anyway that is me done for this video hope you've enjoyed it thank you very much for watching and i'll see you next time